welcome back to my channel if you're new hey so i am getting myself together to go down to the jersey shore to do a brand campaign and also just to chill on the beach and relax and i'm going to take you guys along with me this is like spend the day with me vlog down the jersey shore and i'm excited about it because i needed the beach day y'all <laughs> ever had a beach day since like last year so this is my first time this year going to the beach so i'm super excited about that i'm going to take you guys along with me and especially if you like to spend the day with me vlog down the shore and I just have to make sure everything is straight before I leave out the house. Uh, it takes about maybe an hour, no, probably about 90 minutes to get down the shore from Philly. So yeah, so I'm gonna drive down there and yeah, just kind of just relax. Um, and once I get this campaign done for a brand I'm working on, then it's nothing but relaxation. I'm gonna take you guys, show you some scenes around the Jersey Shore. And um, yeah, it's just gonna be a fun time. I just make sure everything is put together to make sure my birds were taken care of as far as food and water, making sure they're straight. Cause I'm just spending the day down there. I'm not gonna like spend like an overnight. So they're good to go. Um, what else I gotta do? I'm just waking up. So I'm just kind of getting myself together now. Um, I have to get in the shower, do my hair, all that good stuff. So. Yeah, but I wanted to get on here before I actually head on the road because I know if I'm driving, I know I'm not going to be able to, like, vlog, you know, on my phone. So, wanted to kind of get on here before I got on the road and kind of let you guys know what this vlog was about. But, yeah, I'm super excited, y'all. I've been I've been due for a beach day for a minute. And the weather's perfect uh, here in Philly. It's like, um, I believe it's like 65 right now, so it's a nice little breeze coming through the window. Down the shore, they said it's going to be like 74, which is perfect shore weather, no rain, no clouds, just like the perfect picture, perfect weather down. So I am excited about it. I'm going to take you guys along and show you the boardwalk, the water, the attractions, all that good stuff. So, but yeah, so sit back, get your popcorn, your wine, wherever, depends on what time of the day it is for you guys. Um, yeah, we'll just, you know, get something to drink and your snacks and just sit back and relax and we'll take you guys along, show you some of the scenes of the beach and all that good stuff. So, yeah, so, and you guys, can you do me a favor? If you can just like this, if you love travel, beaches, anything, like this video, subscribe, all that good stuff will help you girl out and get my content out there so more people can join our community. I would solely appreciate that. But yeah, so I'm going to get myself together and I'm going to um, get in the shower. My bag is packed. Everything is done. I did everything the night before. That's how I usually get ready. But yeah, so the next time I talk to you guys, I will see you down the shore. Once I finish that, then I'm going to um, play in the water a little bit. The water looks a little calm, not too bad. Um, yeah, but I made it here, y'all. Down here to the Jersey Shore, I made it. it. Feels good down here. I think the weather down here right now is about 72. 
so I am excited to just be down here. This is my first time at the beach this year. <laughs> and um, yeah, so I'll show you some scenes. Behind me, I have to make sure I keep my head on because it's like super windy. And this hat I actually got this cool uh, hookup. This is actually from this glasses, and I had the bathing suit on and the cover up. But you can't see the super windy. suit yeah I'm getting so many compliments on this so I'm about to do this brand campaign and then I'm gonna go play in the water like a little kid <laughs> so I'm gonna see you guys in a little bit everywhere I had to take my hat off because my hat kept blowing this is so windy <laughs> but I got my work done and now time to play it's more than super cold y'all wish me luck show you some scenes that hit the Jersey Shore and I wish I could go over there so that's still here but they're closed until 4 I believe and it's like going on 12 so I can't take you there unfortunately because I'll be probably be going by then only stay here for a couple hours but you kind of so windy y'all <laughs> hope you guys can hear me this is so windy but yeah, everyone's out here. Yeah, I was collecting some seashells because I have a little grass at home. I do like home decor, so I collect some seashells every time I come here. Let me take a look here. Let me show you some of the. Some of them are broken, but some are like okay. Like a hole in it. 
guys so I just got finished coming off the beach and I'm on a boardwalk right now so I'm about to um, just kind of walk up and down the boardwalk to see what's around it's nice out the water wasn't it was cold when I first came but then it started warming up so that was a good thing I was able to play in the water a little bit and now I'm just gonna walk up and down the boardwalk to see what I can see I am hungry uh, so I might want to just check to see if maybe get something to eat and just kind of see, you know, kind of just look around um, what's going on. It was out today. It's really a beautiful day. Uh, I think it's going up to like 74 today down here at the shore. But yeah, um, I had a ball. I had a ball. I got my work done and I was able to play around on the sand in the water. So I'm happy, y'all. And um, yeah, so I'm just trying to de de determine which direction I want to go I think I might want to go forward so I go in this direction it's really nice I'll show you guys some scenes too
All right, guys, I had to get away from Ocean Hotel because of the music. I didn't want to be put into a copyright situation, so I had to move away. So I'm still on the boardwalk. I'm actually just walking. The um, sun actually came out, which is a good thing. And, um, yes, yeah, so I not sure just kind of just browsing you know browsing through the boardwalk i'm gonna show you my view because i went back the other opposite direction towards the hard rock uh hotel and casino and yeah so really nice people are out nice weather and It's like a little mini getaway for me, <laughs> which is cool. I picked the perfect day for sure. I really want to go to this, this place over here, still pier, but they're not open till four. So, bummer, but it's okay. I'll maybe try back another time. A, this is the longest boardwalk ever. I think this is the longest boardwalk, one of the beaches in the world, I believe. When I read the fact about it, this boardwalk is super long. It's feel like it's like never ends. <laughs> I've actually ate here at the Hard Rock. I ate here, I think a year or two ago. I did a vlog on that when I came down here to the Jersey Shore. I had, I think I had brunch here. It was super good, it was good. If you go back to an old, old vlog of mine, you see that I did eat outside and I had um, pretty decent food. I forget what I had, I think it was like an omelet and some other things, some other stuff, but I ate here before. Pretty good brunch. Perfect day to eat outside too. Wish I could eat out today here. Crab house roll bar. Now this is where it gets a lot of people down this end. The other end barely had anybody, but I think everyone's down at this end for some reason. Check that out here, but another time I'll check it out. Yeah, y'all, I'm out here. Sun came out, feeling good. Got my work done. Weather's beautiful. You can't ask for anything else. Yeah. This boardwalk is popping today. A lot of the people out, especially on an off day. Like, I didn't expect this here on the weekend, but on an off day, this is a Tuesday. So I'm really surprised a lot of people is here. <laughs> I have to be quite honest with you. I also ate at the Land Shark. I want to show you, switch over and show you. Please stay right here. Right here. Go closer. I don't think I put like a solid here. It was okay. Eight here. It was pretty cool. It ate at the land shark before. I like to get in here early, like in the morning, like have breakfast. Cause during like later on in the day, I feel like it'd be a lot of people here that everyone wants to eat here because of the, um, uh, I think you get a view of the beach. A nice view, I would like to get. People tend to get like views of that. So let's start here. Yeah, pretty 
it's okay food. You get the view. This is nice because you get like a view of the beach. So, Margaritaville. See these things here? I think because the boardwalk is so long, I think um, <laughs> this is why they have them to take you where you gotta go. This boardwalk is like super long, y'all. <laughs> This is cute. I have to eat. I have to eat here one day, Margaritaville. People out. Look at it amazes me how people still watch people when they have like tripods or like recording themselves like this is like something new we've been doing this for like years y'all i don't know why people still like look but i used to be kind of like uh you know a little like i don't know it was different for me because i never really talk in public and record myself but now i just don't even care <laughs> i'm just doing this content for you guys and that's all it's about uh, i need one of these next time i come here starting to warm up here at the boardwalk it's starting to warm up y'all so i have my like my bathing suit on i have like a jacket over top and i have like some pants I'm walking on the boardwalk time to head back shortly because i actually want to head back and do something at home so i'm only down here for a day but yeah i might get a keychain like a souvenir because i had some keys and I had like some keychains from here and then I had lost my keys in New York during New York Fashion Week last September so um, I want to like we get them keys like keychains for like for my new keys set of keys I had got so, they have a um, saltwater taffy store on the corner here This was a good, good one. I had them before when I was younger, but like I don't really eat saltwater taffies. But it's saltwater taffy store. I think I'm gonna head into this uh, 99 cent store. I'm not gonna record in here because it's gonna feel weird. So I want to show you guys what I got when I get out of the store. But they should have my keychains and things like that in here. So right here it says you can see it. Says, to the 99 cent store but I didn't see what I was looking for so I'm gonna try another store here this used to be Ridley's believe it or not but they're no longer here but they still have the this little pool little earth into the building yeah they're no longer here I came here like one time. It was, it was actually, it's actually good. I liked it. I came here, I think, when I was like maybe a long time, probably like over, more than 10 years. But yeah, this was a cool, I don't know. I'm guessing they closed. I think they closed around the pandemic. I don't think they was really making any money, unfortunately. But sad for a lot of businesses that don't, um, that closed during the pandemic because, um, you know, because of financial difficulties. But here are some stores here. Yeah. And Palace. It's a lot of pizza stores. <laughs> Johnny Rockets. A popular spot here down the Jersey Shore. I've ate here like probably once. It's okay. It's not my favorite place, but I know some people love it. My June is booked up, so I probably got to look at July. Um, okay. Keep this place in mind. Definitely keep it in mind. 
Look for a dollar store, y'all. Because <laughs> the dollar store that I went to, 99 cent store, they didn't even have what I was looking for. So hopefully, I find something. Hey, y'all. So I'm going to actually have to continue this when I get home because my phone battery is about to die, number one. And number two, everywhere I go is like music in these stores. I, I know YouTube is going to slap me with a bunch of copyrights on this video. So um, I wanted to show you more. But you have like the idea of what like the boardwalk Jersey Shore is. And, you know, I showed you the main parts of the beach and things like that. So, yeah, my phone's about to die. My car charger is in the car. So, um, yeah, I'm going to continue this when I get home. But, um, yeah, I'm going to show you one last view before I actually uh, touch bases with you when I get back home. One last view of the boardwalk. Once I hit this dollar store, 99 cent store, get what I need. I'm going to grab something to eat, and then I'm going to head back to Philly and just chill for the rest of the day. But I'm gonna touch bases with you guys when I get home, once I get settled in and everything. Then I'm gonna touch bases with you and you know, kind of reflect on the day. So one last look. I'll be back down here though soon. So this is not the last and only time this summer. I will be back down to Jersey Shore because I love the Jersey Shore so much. I will be back down here and I'll be back down here to blog it <laughs> and vlog it as well. Hey guys, so it's three days later. I don't know why I do this. Like I always say I'm gonna follow up on stuff when I get home and I never do. Like when I went home Tuesday, first thing I did was jump in the shower, get that sand off of me. I went on YouTube and that was all she wrote. Three days later, here I am talking to you now. <laughs> so uh, as promised, I wanted to follow up with you. Um, just kind of like reflect. Perfect beach day weather, it's like 74, 75 degrees. It started warming up, but it still was perfect, no humidity. I had fun, you know, spending the time I was able to get my work done for my brand. I was able to um, submit that to the brand, so the brand is happy, I'm happy. So they're happy, I'm happy, right? So so I submitted that, um, what else? Um, yeah, it was kind of hard to record, do a YouTube because everywhere you walk, like the stores had like music and you know how YouTube is with the, um, the copyright well, you know, copyright situation. So I didn't want to be slapped on with a bunch of copyrights. So I know I'm going to have to put some songs in place of some of the places I went, you know. So don't want to get no copyright on anything. So um, there was that. The water was cold when I first got there, but then it seemed like it warmed up a little bit. Maybe like maybe 20 minutes within. 20 minutes to half an hour. It seemed like the um, it seemed like it warmed up, so it was kind of good. The boardwalk did warm up a little bit. It was started, the sun came out, and it felt like it was a little, little hot, but it wasn't humid. So, um, my battery had ran out. Um, I, I was like on 10%, and I couldn't like record, so I said, okay, well, I'm going to continue this at home. So, after I cut, got like cut off ties with you guys as my battery was about to die. I wound up finding my keychain. I wound up going to the store and finding a few other things. <laughs> Excuse me. Wound up finding a few other things. And after that, I did wind up getting something else to eat. I got like a chicken Caesar salad, which was so good. And I wound up walking around a little bit, taking some pictures, just embracing like the air, the beach air, the water, just taking it all in before I like got back on the road back into Philly. So yeah, so that was pretty much sums up what happened. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna do another beach day again. Probably not at that same location. I might go to another area in Jersey Shore. I might do Ocean City or Wildwood. Um, I'm not sure yet, but I'm definitely gonna vlog that as well. Take you guys along with me to the beach. And um, yeah, so successful beach day. I'm happy. So be able to get my work done and enjoy, relax. So next up is um, 
summer solstice in New York City and Times Square. And that's actually coming next week. By the time this video goes live, it's gonna go live. Um, I sh by the time this video goes live, I should be prepping for that. Yeah, I'm trying to think. Yeah, so should be prepping for that, but that video is coming. So it's the summer solstice in Times Square, which is um, we have yoga in the middle of busy Times Square. So if you haven't seen my other videos, well, only one I think I had from a couple years ago or last year. Check out that video. I'll put it in the description box below. You want to check out that video. That video was a really, really good. If you are interested in doing like yoga in the middle of Times Square, something different, that's something to check out. I do it like every year. The only time I didn't do it was during the pandemic because everything was shut down. But once you know everything got back up, then I've started continuing. Again, I've been going for about maybe... I want to say about a good six years I've been doing this. So, yeah, it's a really good event. It's the first day of summer. So the first day of summer, it kind of like cleanses you. And it kind of like, um, you know, you just kind of feel new. Like once you get into that, uh, you know, um, that state of, that the state of mind doing the yoga. Like I love doing it every year. So that's coming. That's actually, actually after this video. So stay tuned for that. And, um... Yeah, so if you like this video anyway, you love the beach, love spending the day with me, love the beach in general, definitely hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you like fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and travel. And um, thank you so much for coming along with me to the Jersey Shore Beach. And I enjoyed having you. And I hope that you guys will have a great rest of your day. And I'll see you in the next one, which is Summer Solstice Yoga in Times Square.